Hi everyone, my name is Blake Bejarano, and today I'm going to show you how to set write protect on a document inside of the CoCalc platform. You can see I'm at CoCalc.com. I'm going to head over to my projects. Now I can select the project that I'd like to work inside of or create a new one. Here I'm going to go ahead and click on my project. And at this point you can see my file system and I want to go ahead and select a Jupyter Notebook as a quick example. So here I'm going to click on Assignments and I'm navigating the subdirectory here to Assignment 1. And there is Basic Linear Equations, a .ipynb file, and I'll go ahead and select that. And now in order to set Write Protect on my document, what I can do is I can head up to the menu, I can click on Edit, scroll down, and there is a Protect function right here. You could even add this to your toolbar for later if you would like. So now you can see that uh, Protect is now listed in the toolbar. You can remove that by clicking on the icon. Um, but here you can see I can actually set my Write Protect for a particular cell. Um, if you wanted to set this for the entire document, you'd want to use something like Option A to select all of the cells at once. Then you would navigate over to Edit. Again, you'd click on Protect, Write Protect, and now you can see that there's a lock that's present on each of the cells. The other thing that you could do here is maybe you would want to make sure that no one is going to delete a particular cell. Similarly, under protect, there's delete protect. And now you can see that there's also this nice little stop sign that is um, shown here. Um, but that is a quick tip and trick on using the CoCalc UI. Please like, subscribe, and follow for more. And I will see you next time. Thanks again.